We're here in Kampala, Uganda, training the trainers in preparation for Africa Code Week 2016. What's been tremendously exciting about Uganda is that while we've trained over 223 young students, these students and their cohort in the university are now engaging with a wide range of schools and people in education. Uh, we had a team from the Africa Code Week. Uh, the team was from Ireland and they, will be, they were training our trainers and that is all in preparation for the Africa Code Week in October and will be hosted at Makere University. This is very important for the young people of Uganda because it will create a passion among them about computing. It has been really great to meet such experienced trainers and to even meet the young students who really believe that technology is the key to all of our futures. We are all part of this movement and we can all make a real difference in transforming the lives of young African children and youth through Africa Code Week. I'm doing a Bachelor of Science in Electrical Engineering and I also do volunteering with IEEE Uganda and this is my first time to see Africa Code Week in Uganda and it's so interesting. We are really few girls in engineering and I want to encourage so many girls out there to love this and do it in the field and take it on and do it as passion and not to leave it in class because this can show us what we can use the code we learn in class to do out there and change the world. When a girl expresses interest in technology, it's not always encouraged. So as women in technology, we are getting these girls' mentors or role models, trying to inspire them that you can actually do this and, and um, succeed. It's absolutely fantastic to be here this afternoon. I mean, in the run-up to Africa Code Week, which is such a fantastic event. And just to see the enthusiasm of all the students. I sat with two girls earlier on, Jovia and Brenda, and they're such confident girls, really committed to coding and really think that this is going to transform their communities, their societies, the countries. It's just absolutely amazing. As well as training the trainers here, What's really exciting in Uganda is that we've been able to create a significant network of partners already in our visit here. We've had very, very strong support from the Department of Education and Sport and a wide range of other organisations who are all very positive to engage, promote and actually organise events during Africa Code Week. The Resilience Africa Network um, works with innovators and innovations and a key part of innovating is IT. And in order to solve um, Africa's problems and Uganda's problems, we need IT. We believe that partnership is a key thing in getting, in moving things forward. And so that's why I believe um, partnership is so fundamental to the Africa Code Week. And it's necessary to propel this initiative forward. Technology is seen as a driver of innovation to make Uganda a knowledge-based economy. And that's what we strive in our Vision 2030. We need to have uh, people understand technology from the grassroots so that as they grow, they can utilize technology very well. What, what we need to do now is uh, to extend this uh, to all schools and be able to, to have uh, part of the curriculum, have uh, coding, and this is one of the areas that we can include in the, in the, in the curriculum. We encourage being practical also encourage them to go out and uh, try as many things as possible. Because, you know, this world is uh, changing so fast. The, the benefits are enormous. Once you, you have a pool of people who are knowledgeable about it, and especially if you can uh, build the critical mass that, in, that is necessary to go out and disseminate, then that means uh, it will have a trickle-down effect. Here at RUN, we're so excited about Africa Code Week. We're one of the main partners on the Africa Code Week and we're looking forward to seeing this idea birthed in Uganda and to just move forward. If we could harness that enthusiasm and passion that we saw at all of the levels of society that we're going to work with, Uganda is going to have a very bright future. I believe that kids will benefit a lot because of Africa Code Week.